Hi there, everybody. Martin Tyler here, along with the former Arsenal and England striker, Alan Smith. Yeah, you come into ground some days and you do get that buzz of excitement, and I've got it here today, Martin. Looking forward to it. Liverpool, they're playing well at the moment. They certainly played well last time out in their home victory against Bayern Munich. They finished 1-0. It's quite a, a close run affair. But I think they're capable of following up with another win today. I wonder whether Brazil would have done better in the World Cup of 2014 if Coutinho had been in their squad. He's one of those players that sees the picture before the ball arrives and uh, that's why he doesn't get caught in possession too often. And for Shakhtar Donetsk, this is how they're going to go into this game. Bernard comes in for Alex Teixeira, who's shown poor form lately. And today, it's just the one striker in the side. Big reshuffle for Liverpool. Simon Mignolet starts in goal. Nathaniel Klein starts with Alberto Moreno as the fullbacks. Lucas plays alongside Joe Allen in the middle of the park. Christian Benteke is the sole striker today. And the referee today, Rodolfo Costinha. Liverpool then have kicked off. It's a diagonal ball to switch the play here. Now he's looking for support. Nice bit of footwork from the attacker, but it was made too easy for him. Poor defending that. Carrying the ball forward. Lucas. Alan McAnally wants to join us now. He's got a goal to tell us about. It's a goal for Wigan Athletic. Five minutes played, 1 0. Thanks, Alan. Goes for it with a fist. Coutinho. First touch was poor. Yeah, he's got the ball back. Free kick only from the referee. Nothing more sinister than that. Something happening at Chelsea that we need to know about. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Chelsea. 11 minutes played, 1 0. Thank you very much, Alan. Bernard. There's good progress with this attack. It will go into the middle now. Nathaniel Klein. Supporting player alongside. They might open them up now. And here's the shot. The whistle is gone because the assistant flag for offside. Coutinho. And shoots! It's Liverpool who scored! There he was, and very, very coolly taken. Talk about passing the ball into the net. Well, there is a prime example. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Cross coming in. On the pitch, not quite wide enough for him there.
Skirtle. Nathaniel Klein. Coutinho. Advantage for Liverpool. Can they take advantage of that decision? And that's good support as they build this attack. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. Brilliant football from this team. Ivo Corrigi. Giving the ball away now. Trying to get out of the way, the referee. <laughs> but he... Now the shot! He's just reached it, the goalkeeper. And that will be a corner for Liverpool. Allen. Shot off! It's another corner. He's got his shot off now. Fine save he's made there. And he's let the ball escape his grasp. Bernard. Kovalenko. Ventinho. Bernard. Now by the Liverpool man. Now they can go forward, having won the ball. Ivo Corrigi. Lucas. Good passing here. Shots on here. Not by Skirtle. Ivo Corrigi. Daniel Klein. That's the way to win the ball back. Saka. <laughs> and it is the kickoff here for the second half. Lucas Alan Substitution now for the home team. Got the ball back. He's got to cross it now. He spotted a teammate and he's got the technique as well as the vision to switch the play. And they tried to keep it, but they haven't been able to do that. he can cross it throw him for Liverpool put it in well in towards the dangerous Benteke that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that the shot are well saved <laughs> Liverpool's corner
referee sent a player off at Chelsea. We can hear who it is from Alan McAnally. It's a red card for the home team. They're down to 10 men. 64 minutes played. It remains 3 0. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. Coutinho. bench a substitute is clearly getting ready to come on good distance to the clearance then and we'll start again with a goal kick Sacco. Origi. And they're going to get a throw in. The system working out which way it is. Nathaniel Klein. Fred. And they've got to score soon. Well, I think we're going to see some, some Route 1 stuff here, Martin, in the next few minutes. Might not be pretty, but I'll be hoping it'll be effective. It's time for the substitution. Trot on! Well, what a miss. That would have been the equaliser. And he knows it too, doesn't he? Look at his expression. He'll just be praying he gets another chance to make amends. Goal news from... Park de Prince, Alan McAnally. It's the second goal for Napoli. It's been scored by Marek Hamchik. A wonderful overhead kick that sent the ball flying into the roof of the net. 79 minutes played. 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. He's cut out that pass. It wasn't an accident. He read the mind of the opponent. Bernard. Well, that's a good challenge between the two of them there. Daniel Klein. Still one down. And they're chasing the game with five minutes to go. Got to cross it. Very impressive, the support for this team. Funny the team could be quite so impressive themselves. Yeah, they're doing their bit, the supporters, they really are. So, just wonder whether it can transfer onto those players down on the pitch. Well, they got that. 